fluids maintain their volume and take the shape of the container. That's why they are called incompressible. They possess the ability to conform to any container they are placed in, be it a beaker or a graduated cylinder. An excellent example of an incompressible fluid is water. In the video, we use water that we have colored with confectionery paint. When poured into the 300 ml beaker, it takes the shape of the beaker. When poured into the 250 ml graduated cylinder, it takes the shape of the, the 250 ml cylinder. When poured into the 100 ml graduated cylinder, it takes the shape of the, the 100 ml cylinder. The volume of water remains constant and equal to 100 ml.